Um, what type of back complaints do you hear from your patients? And I'm going to start with you, Dr. Pazionis. Sure, so uh, within my practice, I'll see both patients with benign and malignant spine conditions. So patients with benign spine conditions will come in from just uh, you know vague back aches, difficulty with their everyday activities, activities of daily living, mm -hmm. and also patients who have more severe pain. So unfortunately, uh, pain that is keeping them up at night, they can't sleep and things like this. Um, occasionally can be also associated with uh, shooting pains down the legs, mm. and that's uh, dependent on whether the how the fracture looks like and uh, how it's happened. If they're a patient who's presenting with tumor, it can also be associated with fevers, chills, night sweats, uh, things that we call B symptoms clinically. Um, so there's a variety of different presentations, but overall patients are very uncomfortable and it's very disturbing uh, and they're looking for a way that they can alleviate their pain. And Dr. Mann, I'm sure you see this too, and, and all ages, I yeah. can imagine, mm -hmm. right? That's correct. What do you see? Uh, normally, the type of patient for this type of condition, I will see two, uh, two, two major type of population. One will be the elderly patient that normally they suddenly develop back problems and they uh, we catch the patient and they have a fracture. The other one will be traumatic fractures from mainly from sports. Uh, athlete that they had a trauma, they were hit, and uh, all of a sudden they, we find that the patient has, a, or the athlete has a, a compression fracture or a spine fracture as well. And I'm sure a lot of patients that come in are maybe taken aback when they hear they have this or, or, or are surprised? Yes. Right? Yes. Uh, most of the patients, once they hear a fracture, they, they think that they can get paralyzed. Oh. And actually, to be quite honest, the answer is no. Most of the time, we might be able to treat them and avoiding sequelas of, uh, of the, from the compression fracture if we take that on time.